안녕하세요. My name is Celeste, and today I'm going to be reacting to a group called Z Girls that got requested. Yeah, let's get started. Where's my tea? I got lipstick on my Valentino bag. As usual, as you all know, we can't show, I can't let you hear any of the music, which is a darn shame, because I don't want all the revenue I'm not making to get copyright claimed or something. This actually does quite a bit remind me of K-pop, but... Wow. Okay, okay, so I'm noticing really good dance, really good choreography. I love the styles, the loose mesh, I'm liking it, and the plaid, everything about this. Oh, I really like that plaid outfit, actually. You can see their style of dance is kind of loose and free, like it's, uh, I would say slightly less controlled than what I'm used to seeing. I love that plaid skirt, that's really cute. I really like plaid, in case y'all didn't figure that out. This, this dress right here kind of reminds me of, uh, Jihyo's outfit in, um, uh, Yes or Yes. Beautiful voice. This denim jacket, this denim and plaid jacket is bold. I really like it. I like the, the detached sleeves on the one outfit. Oh, okay. This is a good rap bridge. Whoa, okay, high note. Get it, get it, girl. Wow. She belted that. Okay. This girl, this girl right here has like a totally different look from everyone else here. Like her style I think is more mature. She's got like a really sultry kind of makeup look. It's really unique. I like this little, this little, this little tease of blue she's got in her hair. It's kind of cute. Wow, okay. That's a really nice voice. This girl right here, this one, she's got a lovely deep voice. Wow, okay. The, the one member who has like a totally different look from the rest of them is like, she really stands out to me, obviously. Like, I really like, really like what I'm seeing here, actually. Here we have another one, Streets of Gold. This one's got a lot of pink. Oh, we'll see. Okay. So far, this has totally different aesthetic already. Okay, that's an interesting little makeup look we have going on. Lots of sparkles. Did I just see some two-toned hair for a second? Yeah, she's got blonde bangs and her hair is red. Okay. Bold I love the glasses. I like me some big round glasses. Yeah, it's so cute. Oh, I like the little tiny Dutch braids. Yeah, that's how we do it. There's like a lot of energy here. She looks Indian. Is she Indian? I really like the hair accessories in this video. All little sparkly hair pieces are really cute. I feel like we don't see a whole lot of hair accessories these days. Like people are, like most of hairstyles that I see, at least in the West, don't really have a lot of accessories. I feel like, I just wish we would see more of those. Like give me some more sparkly clips, give me more headbands, you know? Hold on, hold on, I wanna see that hairstyle again. This one, I like it with the tiny braids that are coming out the ponytail. I like the kind of, is it, is it she? Yeah, she's got like an interesting little, uh, it's hard to tell in the lighting exactly what her makeup style is, but kind of looks like, kind of reminds me of, uh, I don't remember what it's called, but you remember the uh, hangover makeup style that was popular in Japan for a while? I don't know if, if it's still popular or not. But this kind of reminds me of that with the sort of rosy across the nose, almost sunburnt kind of look, kind of flushed look. That's what that reminds me of. Did she just have sparkles in her eyebrows? Yeah, she got sparkles in her eyebrows, dude. <laughs> I like it, I like it. Interesting choice to have the song called Streets of Gold and not really have any gold in the video, but they did a lot of sparkles. Uh, sparkles and like the bling and everything so that there's that what is z-pop exactly i'm actually so shook at how many views my last video got like i'm actually so surprised um like it i mean by my standards it really blew up like that was like the first video ever to get over a hundred views in a day so thank you guys so much i would think i got 
I, I think it would be awesome if we could get if I could get up to a hundred subscribers like by the end of the month that would be so cool or like at all like in my life so go ahead and give me a subscribe if you would and ring the bell so you know and I'm gonna do some more reaction videos I do a bit of gaming as well but I may move to more and more reaction videos because that's what I'm seeing requested a lot and that's what you guys are wanting so uh, thank you guys so much and let's see if we can get to a hundred subscribers that would be so cool I'm so happy I don't actually know what Z pop is they it says they have members from Indonesia Indonesia, Philippines, Japan, Vietnam, Thailand, Taiwan, and India, which is actually really interesting because I think it's really cool when like different nationalities get together like that. Like like twice is kind of similar. So what is what is Z-pop exactly? It seems to be like based in Korea. Uh, it's got a different feel from the other like actual K-pop that I've seen though, and what this uh, what what this commenter uh, Anissa Latif says is that they are not claiming to be k-pop they are z-pop inspired by k-pop but from what i'm seeing it looks like z-pop is actually quite a new concept so um it's hard to say exactly what this is going to evolve into but i think it's really cool because it's definitely unique and not only is it unique from other things like it but it's also that may sound oxymoronic to be unique from things like it but um it's also like those two songs i saw were distinct from each other as well. Uh, we have Z-Boys, okay. You know what, let me let me go ahead and check out Z-Boys. Seems to be owned by the same, or rather signed with the same company. So let me, let me see what Z-Boys is about. Why not? Okay, we got edgy concept, that's always a good thing. <laughs> oh nice, <laughs> Miz Z. You know what? Right off the bat, this reminds me of, um, is it at ease? I watch a lot of K-pop mashups to be honest, so I can't remember. I can't keep my groups straight. At ease, at ease, at ease. I'm sorry. At ease, at ease. It's pronounced at ease. Uh, <laughs> I like his like bright pink underneath his hair. I like this 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 kid with orange hair in the back. Here. This one right here. I like him already. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. I like the little collar. That's cute. All the harnesses is nice aesthetic. That that orange hair kid is pretty cute. Oh, the one the one the one guy who has the I'm sorry I probably should call them kids because I don't actually know how old they are, but um the one with a asymmetric harness kind of kind of cool. I feel like he may be the really edgy one of the bunch. It's hard to tell though. Like the blue hair, everything is looks good. Everything looks good. Yo, his shirt. What is that I'm seeing? Is that like a black on black like design there? Yeah, yeah, cause it like, cause you can only see it in the light. That's really cool. I like that. Who who doesn't like some black on black designs? Honestly. Okay, okay. They have attitude. I like it. And lace sleeves on a guy is new to me. I have I don't usually see that. Oh, does he have a man bun? Excuse me, excuse me. Okay, I, I need to see more of this guy. Excuse me, can you show me that guy again? Because I don't. It, he may have just had his hair slicked back, but it looked like he might have had a man bun there. Whoa! Okay, we got a rapper. Okay, both of the colorful hair boys got, got good rapping skills. Okay. Yeah, he, dude has a man bun. It never ceases to amaze me how, like, all the, like, all of these Asians can look good in, like, every hair color under the sun. That, that's, that's, that just, that just shooks me, you know? What else do we have here in the way of Z-pop? Okay. Gonna continue with the edgy, the edgy theme. Oh, that gave some glasses, okay. Oh, that's a nice lyric. So if the sky is the limit, then we ain't going high enough. I like it. I like it. Is that the kid who had the orange hair in the other video? Oh, wow. Okay. This guy has got totally different style. Look, at, he's got a square jaw. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> I like his hair. Okay. Nice, nice. Looks cool. 
was he was this guy in the other one because i don't think i saw that guy in the other video the one with the really square jaw i don't remember him from the other video i mean they all have different hair here so i don't know <laughs> So this company, this label is based in Korea, right? So I feel like in in Z Boys and in Z Girls, they each have like the one member that's got totally different look from the rest of the group. And I'm wondering if they're like trying to like step out and expand a little bit, like by like having the one member that's sort of sort of doing something a little different. I wonder if that's what they're trying to do there. I'm not expressing that very well. I hope y'all understood what I'm trying to get at. Let me see. Let me look up these members. Okay, we have Z Girls members. Oh, they're on K profiles. Cool. Easy. Okay, we have Carlin is from the Philippines. Mahiro is Japanese. Vanya is Indonesian. Oh, she was the one with the blonde bangs and the red the red hair. Oh, this was the one with the the, the sort of flushed makeup style I was noticing. Queen, I like her stage name. <laughs> okay. Queen is Vietnamese. This is the one I was noticing. Yeah, Priyanka is Indian. I was right. Yeah, with the the sparkle eyebrows. Oh, oh, here we get a good look at the uh, little little hair accessories she's got going on here. That's pretty cool. Joanne is looks like Chinese Taiwanese. Uh, Belle is Thai. Okay. Yeah. Is this the is this the one I was noticing with the the black on black design? The, the lighting made that look especially cool. That's a bold choice. That's a bold choice, my dude. Matt Mavin is that how you pronounce that? I really need to see. Sometimes I just need to see things written in Hangul so I know I'm pronouncing it right. This is Indonesian. We have. Perry is Taiwanese. No, it was this one. This is the one I was I was pointing that out. Okay, I see now it's like it's like got sheer panels on it. Roy is Vietnamese. And those are the lace sleeves I was noticing. Uh Josh is Filipino. Sid, this is oh oh I did notice him. Okay, I was distracted by his man bun, so I didn't notice. Um, oh, he's got a little braid here going on too. Okay, who's this guy? Sid, he's Indian. Yeah. Oh, and this is the one with the pink hair, the rapper with the pink hair guy from Japan. Blink, okay. Blink is Thai, he's Mangne. Ah, no wonder he's so cute. Um, yeah, and these are actually, these these kids are, are actually really young. Wow, okay. And he's quite young. He's 16, and the next youngest after him is 20. So he's Mangne by quite a margin. So a lot of people are basically like calling these like K-pop groups without any Korean members, but it looks like they're actually based in Korea anyways. But even so, like, I think that's neither here nor there. We had, you know, two groups, four videos, and all of them were not only like unique from what I've seen elsewhere, but were also distinct from each other. Like this is, uh, these are groups that are putting out new material and it's really, really good. Like their choreography is good. Their style is good. They're voices are good they have good rappers good singers and the lyrics that i noticed were also really good like this is this is just <laughs> this is just some excellent uh, music production that we're seeing here um i noticed when i was editing my last video that i need a thesaurus so i'm trying to expand my vocabulary a little bit okay i'm actually using words like excellent instead of just good see this is that big brain at work here <laughs> okay so that was um my like honest reaction to Z girls and Z boys as requested and I have a few other requests to get to as well that are going to be on the way if y'all want to see some more reaction videos uh, please request them tell me what groups you want to see me react to next I really like this new direction that my channel is going just like basically reacting to music groups from 
literally around the world is so cool to me because there's just there's so much like music out there to discover that I had never really been exposed to before so this is a really cool way for me to experience that and I'm glad I started doing this so if y'all want to see me react to more music groups please leave a request down below and I will go and check them out if I possibly can I'll try to get to all of them and I definitely have more on the way that I'm about to go record so yeah if you want to see those videos as soon as they come out make sure you hit the subscribe button y'all know how the bell icon works y'all know what likes are for I would love to reach a hundred subscribers that would be so awesome. Hello, uh, my the, the my brother says hi, and uh, with that being said, I will see y'all very soon. Take care. Stay safe out there.